So today we are dyeing my hair burgundy. Hopefully, I have here Rubin, which is a dark red, I guess. I really forgot how these colors look like. <laughs> and also dark tulip. I think this is a burgundy. This is actually burgundy, but I already have. I have pretty much blue pigments in my hair, so I want more of these red pigments. I will be using more of the rubin and less of the dark tulip. And I think I'm going to mix both of them and put it in my hair. But I will award my roots this time because mm, the other reds I've used before lift, they make my natural hair lift pink. And once I try to bleach them, so I will avoid my roots as much as possible. So I won't get um, pink roots in the end when I bleach them. I hope this is going to look nice and look burgundy. Oh, this is a pretty nice shade. Let's look at this, how this looks like. Oh, this also looks pretty much red. Okay, I have this much of rubin. I almost use the same amount of them, so... Let's put it on my hair. I will start with the bottom part this time because when I'm trying to avoid my roots, this is the easiest way, I would say. I don't think that I will I will do a great job avoiding my roots because, yeah, I'm not real great at that. And I cannot see my roots properly. Actually, I'm finished with applying this on my hair and I have left with this much of color. I will just apply it on the ends of my hair. Make sure that everything is colored. Okay, so I'm going to let this sit for 40 to 45 minutes probably and then rinse this out maybe more rinse this out come back show you guys the results okay guys this color is not even close to what i was planning for and yeah <laughs> i will 
Okay, so I wasn't expecting my hair to turn out this dark and it actually looks a lot purplish more than I expected um, but overall I actually really like the color like the, this is so nice this actually looks almost like black but it's not black it's also reflecting and there's just some um, brighter and actually the color is pretty nice i actually really like dark color i like most of the colors that's my problem that's why i cannot leave my hair alone because i like almost every color but i didn't have such a dark color in a while a long while yeah, i really like it but i don't like how my hairstyle looks right now it's it, i feel like it makes me look a little bit older than i usually do i also really like how it blends how my natural regrowth blends to the purplish burgundyish color i don't know which color this is like plum I don't know, like really dark purple. Oh, I don't like how it looks like right now. This color looks really, really, really nice. And my hair actually look pretty healthy with this color because it's, it's covering up the damages because it's a really dark color. Oh my God, I cannot believe this looks so good. All right, guys. This was all for today's video and I think this is the last time I'm dyeing my hair in 2021. So thank you guys all for watching and see you in my next video. Bye!